paranoid perceptions, feeling you are being followed or watched. This is Ned Ned Nerb, the schizophrenic, with day 31 of 100 symptoms. Paranoia can be one of the most disruptive symptoms of schizophrenia and psychosis. It leads to isolation, fear, anxiety, strange behavior, and judgmental regard from others. It is totally distracting and hard to shift the mind from it. Medication has an effect on its severity. However, I find paranoia comes and goes over the years, but it is always present in some degree. I think what changes most between times of relative stability and the times of intermittent distress is not the fact of paranoid tendency, but the fact of what the mind happens to do with that energy. Specifically, if someone feels paranoid and then concludes something delusional and imagined about the target of the thoughts, they are likely to potentially make other decisions based on that. Those are paranoid delusions. However, paranoid perception lies at the base and I would argue is at least more common than the delusions. For example, I might recognize that I saw a stranger twice in a period shorter than one day and think, are they following me? I might glance around a busy transit vehicle and catch eye contact repeatedly and think, what do they know about me? Why are they watching me? Sometimes I walk in a busy area and I have the random apprehension that others know about me. What they might know might come to mind or there might be random anxiety and fear when I see a stranger who looks angry or potentially violent. However, I emphasize again that this is not actually or strongly delusional because I'm saying there is no lasting belief. I look at delusions as fixed beliefs and in these paranoid experiences, my thoughts are still flexible and I can avoid the beliefs that would cause me to stress out even more. Thanks for watching. Ask any questions in the comments below. Please subscribe and share. Thank you. You're listening to Ned Ned Nerb, the Schizophrenic, with day 31 of 100 symptoms. Bye for now.